Hey guys, PV6 here, metal detecting in Alaska. It's 6 a.m. here in Fairbanks. And uh, I'm out for a Sunday morning hunt. Gonna hit this playground, haven't hit it for a while. Used to be an entrance right there, but they're doing some kind of construction for the hospital. And uh, so they got that blocked off, so hmm. That ought to make it a little bit interesting. Wonder if anybody's been in there or what. Let's get in there and get ground balanced and uh, hey, let's see what we can find. You just never know. It's a great thing about metal detecting. It's so much fun. All right, here we go. Well, I'm out today with my uh, Fisher F44. And uh, you know, I got lucky. I've been sending emails to Fisher uh, Laboratories for years saying look at me look at me and uh, anyways they finally I guess noticed and sent me this F44 to try out up here in Alaska and uh, I guess uh, I'm gonna give it a run here when it gets cold in the winter and we'll see how it does but uh, yeah they sent it to me just to try out and test so I'm loving that thanks Fisher okay so I thought I'd come over to this little uh, playground first and check this out first target I just ground balanced I'm not sure what it is let's check it out oh it's a loony cool I haven't found one of these in a while this is a uh, one dollar loony from Canada sweet that's big money, finding dollar coins. Nice. All right, let's keep looking. Oh, check this out, I got another signal right by it. And it's reading even higher. Oh, look at there. Look, I haven't even put the loony away yet. So there's a loony and a quarter. All right, let's scan and make sure there's nothing else Let's there. go ahead and get this out of the way. Finding my first pull tab. Link to a chain, a bike chain. Well, I just found my first zipper of the day. And it sounded really good, too. First little piece of jewelry. Solid 66. Penny. good sign I found a loony a quarter and a nickel so I don't think anybody's been here for a little while so hopefully we'll find something decent here still having fun no matter how it turns out well I was putting off a heck of a signal oh looky there what we got here? Ah, oh, ring. It was pinging in the gold range too. Wow, look, it has a little fox. Is that what that is, a fox? All right, I'm looking for markings, but hey, Ring 20, a fox ring, ring 20, I'm looking at you. Mwah. 
Give that box a kiss. I found ring 20. Sweet. All right, well. Was pinging in the gold range, so. Looks to me like, if anything, it might have been plated at one time. Sweet. Ring 20. Yeehaw. All right. This is the fourth ring for the uh, Fisher F44. So it's doing a pretty good job. Well, I found me uh, some carrots. Solid 79. Well, no shortage of targets out here this morning, so that's nice. I like digging up coins. Well, I've been hunting in all metal mode, so this was giving off one heck of a signal. Let's keep looking. Now well, found what's left is some kind of piece of jewelry. Okay, so I think this is like my fourth hunt with the uh, Fisher F44. And each time I've been out, I've been out for, you know, three to five hours. And the battery just came off the full mark to the two-thirds full. So batteries seem to last a, quite a while like I said four hour hunts I mean you know I'm about up to 20 hours close to it well this is kind of a first I just dug up a uh, cassette tape the winnings let my people go Hey, 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 all right. Love finding these matchbox cars. Hot Wheels, matchbox, whatever they are. Sweet, futuristic design. Was oh, it open up? Oh, maybe not. Wow. Well, I've been finding lots of coins, but uh, here's a bicentennial quarter. Cool. 1976 bicentennial quarter. Well, you know, I do get a little satisfaction from getting this kind of stuff off the playground. Because, boy, I'd hate for my child to step on that. So let's get this out of here. Little piece of a chain. Okay, I'm getting a signal here. And look at this. Oh, oh, it is a ring. Damn it, I thought it was. So wait. And it was pinging in the gold range also. Looks like it's a possibly plated too. I don't care. Ring 21. And this is ring 5 for the Fisher F44. Man. Ring 21. I just got distracted. Check this out. I looked over this way. And look at this. There's four quarters laying right there. Isn't that crazy? 1981, it looked old. Oh, look at that, five quarters. We'll have to scan there. That's why I got distracted. It was all them quarters laying there. Ring 21, sweet. 
in the words of uh, the famous Russ Balbarona, nice. All right. Ring two for today. I've been doing really good with the Fisher F44. Uh, four hunts and uh, five rings. Cool. Doing okay, good. so I think that was a massive corn spill. I found five quarters so far. There's six. Oh my goodness. Six quarters, seven quarters, eight quarters, nine quarters. And this is just in one spot. Up, oh, look at there. Ten quarters. Let's give the area a quick scan here. Up, oh, and there's another one there. Up, oh, look at there. All right, that makes 11 quarters so far. That's probably it. All right, whoop. Oh, just a uh, paper clip. All right, cool, that was a big coin spill. Uh, $2.25. Or no, 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 it was, uh, Two dollars and seventy-five cents. Wow, that's a good coin spill. Old rusty nail. Let's get that off the playground. You know? All right, so I did that one little playground. I did not do the little toddler playground on the other side of it. Ah, <sighs> but man, I found a lot of targets at that last one. So let's go over to this one here. This is where all the teenagers like to hang out. Uh, on the weekends in the evening, so who knows what I'll find over here. Well, so far I've been finding lots of change over here, too. And uh, just found this. I just got a target here. And... Oh, all right. I like them when they have something on the end. Cool. I don't think it's silver or anything, but. Got some little diamonds and a key to a heart, or you know, where you can stick a key in that heart. Yeah. Cheap necklace, but cool. I like finding stuff like that. Well, working my way out. One last pass by these uh, swings, and I'm gonna head to the car. And uh, probably stop and get me a uh, polar bear coffee which is a white mocha with vanilla. Mocha dang. Well, that wasn't a bad hunt. Found two rings. I found probably $5 and change, if not more. And uh, a little bit of dabs of jewelry and had a great time. I just wish I had a buddy to go with me every time. So I could yell, look what I found. All right, guys, till next time, good luck and happy hunting. I'll uh, lay the, everything out I found so you can see. Uh, so far, I'm pretty pleased with the Fisher F44. Uh, it's finding everything my gold bug would find, so it's doing pretty good. Uh, four hunts and five rings, so doing pretty good so far. Okay, guys, time for the roundup. Here's all the stuff I found today. Here's all the wire and paper clips. I uh, found this little electronic part. I don't know what that is. A lot of aluminum foil, maybe. A uh, bunch of screws, nails, chunks of uh, rusty stuff, ball bearings. Found this. I'm going to keep that for a spare for my trailer hitch. Um, pieces to fence. All these old bolts and stuff like that. Uh, bottle caps. This looks like off a flash drive. Parts off lighters. Uh, bolts and nuts, all these pencils, found this cassette tape, found all these hair doodads, got all these pieces to zippers and buttons, little piece to a watch. Okay, so I found 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 29 pennies, 10 nickels, 
10 dimes and the oldest one was a 1965 of course couldn't have been one year older uh, and then I found uh, 16 quarters one of which is a Canadian and one was a bicentennial a 1976 it says 1776 to 1976 so those are good I, I saved those and I found my first loony for the year a, can, a Canadian one dollar looks like 1987 maybe and then I found this cool little matchbox car and here's the little bits of jewelry I found today found this necklace with a little fake diamond in the shape of a heart little pieces to jewelry stuff that broke off a little piece of a chain I found like a little Mickey Mouse pinned it must have went on the end of a chain or something a little star I found ring 20 which was this little fox ring and I don't see any markings in there I haven't really looked with a loop yet but put my glasses on so that helped considerably <laughs> and then here is ring 21 got a sweet little stone and uh, they both look like they've been plated and some of the platings wore off so but anyways two more rings uh, started using the F44 four hunts ago and in that time I found five rings so far so uh, it's doing pretty good found all this today with the F44 alright guys till next time good luck and happy hunting <laughs>